Catholic News World. The name Andrew comes from Greek Andrea, meaning manhood, or valor. Like other Greek names, it appears to have been common among the Jews from the 2nd or 3rd century BC. Saint Andrew, the Apostle, son of Jonah, or John, was born in Bethsaida of Galilee. He was the brother of Simon, Peter. Both were fishermen, and at the beginning of our Lord's public life occupied the same house at Capernaum. From the fourth gospel we learn that Andrew was a disciple of the Baptist, whose testimony first led him and John the Evangelist to follow Jesus. Andrew at once recognized Jesus as the Messiah, and introduced him to his brother, Peter. Thenceforth the two brothers were disciples of Christ, and then they left all things to follow Jesus. And in the various lists of apostles given in the New Testament he is always numbered among the first four. As one of the twelve, Andrew was present at the Last Supper, beheld the risen Lord, witnessed the Ascension, shared in the graces and gifts of the first Pentecost. When the apostles went forth to preach to the nations, Andrew seems to have taken an important part. Nicephorus, states that Andrew preached in Cappadocia, Galatia, and Bithynia, Scythian deserts, afterwards in Byzantium itself, and finally in Thrace, Macedonia, Thessaly, and Achaia. He was crucified by order of the Roman governor, Aegeus at Patria in Achaia, and he was bound, not nailed, to the cross, in order to prolong his sufferings. The cross on which he suffered was in the form of an X. His martyrdom took place during the reign of Nero, on 30th of November, in AD 60. St. Andrew's relics were brought to Italy and placed in the Cathedral of Amalfi, where most of them still remain. St. Andrew is the patron saint of Scotland, Russia, Sicily, Greece, Romania, Amalfi, Lucca, Malta, and Prussia, army rangers, mariners, fishermen, fishmongers, rope makers, singers and performers. Please subscribe to Catholic News World's YouTube channel. Thanks and God bless.